Yep. Back on the usual grind again. Anyway, I know there ain't no titles, but let's just do the whole stupid thing if this is always after the titles, but give me them titles! Ah! <laughs> anyway, morning, afternoon, good evening, good night, wherever the fluff you are. And welcome to another episode of Up the Ticks. Today, we will be watching Wigan Athletic take on Doncaster Rovers. Now, Doncaster are joint bottom of the table at the moment. Um, it's crew the joint bottom of the table with on one point. Uh, we're going to, so it's like fourth, fifth or maybe even sixth, not 100% sure, uh, with 10 points. So this is going to be entertaining. It's always good when there's uh, some, uh, some good opposition. And I know that they are, let's say, bottom-ish area of the table, but to be honest, this early in the season, everyone's kind of in false positions, effectively, including Wigan, even though they are on an absolute blinding run. But, you know, everything is a bit on the uh, false positions, really, until we start to get kind of like late September into November that's when it seems to settle itself out but beyond that nothing else seems to really matter with that one along with uh, today as well Warriors are away at Hull and it's Hull FC yeah Warriors are up in Hull that is, I think that's a three o'clock kickoff as well I believe anyway so that one's going to be entertaining going to be tasty and what I can see whilst I'm on my approach here into the stadium Looks like there was quite a bit, a good turnout from the Donny lads. Doesn't look like there's quite a few come out, come over from there. So, you know, I know there was a couple of hundred from Pompey last time I was here. So they made quite a good noise. And I'm sure the guys from Donny are going to make some good old noise as well. I am going to be closer to the away end this time. Rather than where I've been sat for the past few games, probably more of this side of it but well, we will see so we'll see you inside what bar demolished seat well, sorted about 15 minutes yet before kick off but hey not too bad in here too we sit here fishing at noon yeah no too much batchy still no passionate so it's good gonna be entertaining anyway a few of the lads are still back in it. Not seen one on the newest signing yet. They might be in too. That'll be uh, all fun. So I'm going to hazard a prediction. As you throw the prediction out all season, I'm going to hazard a prediction. I'm actually going to throw it out. I'm going to say 2-1 I'm going to say 2-1 to that It's one of those things that just never count out the team you never count out the team that's uh, lower in the, in the table just because if they can that's to bite you if you do with the rest of it Hey all being well, this is going to be quite a good run of games if I can sort out the finances. But we will see. Anyway, whilst it's still a bit quiet, any don't have fans or any any uh, ringing fans, stick your ideas down below of how you think the game went. I know you'll be watching. Get Skelly. I'm not a fan of Sky, but whatever. Never really been a fan of Sky. But whatever. But we will see. Anyway, get back to you with some action. Oh, Donnie scored. Tom Lowe. 
Uh, yeah, uh, they've got it. We had the early pressure, we were pushing, we just didn't quite take it. A few chances where we could have done it. And it's just not quite fall for us. But, you know, hey, we could always get into it. And as I said, don't ever discount the lower team, because they can spark you. But just a little bit loose at the back. Just needs to just get a bit tighter. She also needs to get a bit tighter. Not let him get up the skin. Also, any chance we get, just take a spank on it. But hey, anyway. Right back. One minute after, straight off the creek, straight in the net. A little bit of to do going on at the edge as well. We've just seen what's going on. There's a little bit of a to do between some of the Donny players and the England players in the group pop. So what's going on here? A little bit going for it. Cool. So we got one all now. Flip in the fingers, there was just mob. There was a thing that was covering the screen, I need to clear it. It's the problem when you're on the cell phone. But yeah, anyway. Yeah, it is. I'll just quickly swing you around. Zoom in. Uh, swing back out. Got another chance going on right now. No moment looking to bubble. Oh, Ooh. oh! Stuck in on him. Oh, he's taken down. He could be a pen. No. Oh, that was close. That was a little bit close there. Do the quick half time catch. Ended the first half, ended one all. Could have been too warm. Could have been. The performance that could have gone in, but you know. It all flows differently, it all flows differently. Not too bad. Just while taking stitches for that. Interesting. The Republican. 
There we go. Fans of either side, stick it down below what you think. How you think it's gone, what, what you think some of the decisions were fair or contentious or what. I can only see it from my angle. You probably have better seat than me. So hey, we will find out in a minute. A bit of confusion in the box there as well. A little bit. Was a little question. It was one player offside. But hey, don't matter. You take it where it goes. Because it could come back and get us one more. Number 10, Hugh Keane. Number 2. How there. Could he get a hat trick? And whilst I'm looking at that, Newcastle have just equalised. One of the, the Donny manager or one of the guys has gone has uh, been uh, yellow carded as well. They have one earlier, so it's another one. The one of their assistants has been uh, given a yellow. So it's getting it's getting tasty. Wait, we're on two one. Well, to be honest, I want us to get more goals. Just to put more on. And I'll let you hear this. Oh, that fizzled out. That one fizzled out a little bit, but hey, we've still got the pressure though. We've still got possession. Just need to keep just keep being productive and giving it a cheeky chance. Again, it's just floating. Donny fans, what are you reckon for that one? Stick it out below. Two, one. Not a bad result. How did I do that? I ain't got a clue. How? Just felt like it was going to be a 2 1 game, but it ended up 2 1. Hmm. After being 1 0 down, where we did lose concentration a little bit at the back and then coming back pretty much within about 30 odd, well, within about a minute or two and then getting a nice little break to get second. Not bad, not a bad result at all. But I am going blind because the sun in my fifth. So I wasn't exactly wasn't brilliant at first because of some of the possession that play that we had where we could have taken control a little bit more and could have put it in. But hey up, don't matter. We still managed to collect it, still managed to get the three points. Another bonus as well is Warriors won. Ten to zero. I don't know if I'll be at that game though. I don't know I don't know if I'll be yeah here for the final regular season game against Catalan Dragons, not 100% sure. I've got to check out all of the money and all of that chisel that goes with that. There's been a lot less in this one, obviously, because I'm trying to cut down the fluff that goes in there, just as extra filler and everything. But, you know, not bad. Not bad that way. Not a bad game in total. Let's see if we can just quickly just like you know, cut across so I don't have to cross further up. But all in all, not a bad game. Anyway, a few chances though. The subsidy did come on a little bit late for some people for us. But then again, subs are subs. Subs can make or break a game. Now subs, well. Richardson kept them out, kept the main lads out there as long as he felt was necessary. It wasn't too bad to honest. I'm not sure how Bolton did because I know last time so it's on Bolton they were two no, no, three two ahead at the half. Didn't really go on about that one. For United 
well, Man United, because of Ronaldo, I've only paid attention to that one because of the return of uh, Cristiano Ronaldo. He got a double, it ended 4-1. That one wasn't exactly a bad game either by the looks of that report. So I'll be checking that one out tonight. All in all, got a win, got a three points. Keeps us up for the table. Donny, good team actually. Quite a strong team. And the looks of the way that they were out with that one. Game yeah, was plenty to worry about. And to be honest, if you guys can hook it up and actually, you know, string it together and get a nice good bit of good luck, you might actually be able to trouble some other teams. As you took the lead, which to be honest, some people weren't thinking you would do. So you got you got the lead, you could have done it. To be honest, if you'd have just rode your luck a little bit more, uh, falling your way, guys, you could actually have taken that. To be honest, I'm being brutally honest here, at the end you could actually have had that. You could have had that as a point. You could have taken a scalp there. We rode our luck and got away with it. It seems to be the way it is at the moment. It's just that we're just about getting away with it. Ins and outs we're getting away with. We're getting the luck. After all of that time, possibly not having a club anymore, something positive and something good's coming of it. Uh, anyway, guys, for your views and comms, down below, don't forget to slap that like button, share the bejeebus out of this, a bit like Tyson Fury, and give that sub button. A black eye. And that's me out. Peace.